Mr. Depp, what's reflected in these photographs? Um, there were some scratches. Um, I, uh, another altercation, and there were some misheard uh, come at me with uh, her nails or hand scratch scratching at me. And who took these photographs of you? Once again, I believe this was Mr. Pett, Sean Pett. And when were these photographs taken? Uh, uh, seems to be Christmas, or ten, ten days before Christmas, the f 15th of uh, December 2015. Mr. Depp, do you remember what led to um, you having these scratches on your face? This was... Um, Yet again, another confrontation where um, as was my regular practice, there had been an altercation. She, she, she was, um, <clears throat> she had some rage issue with me. And um, I remember that I was trying to go to my corner as it were which is i went i was going into my office in, in the in penthouse three which is upstairs and as i was approaching the door to my office um miss heard ran out of the master bedroom or our bedroom and uh started uh, just throwing wild punches at uh, at, at me, at the back of my head, at the side of my head, at my anything that she could connect with, and um, I had to. Uh, I I would have to show you uh, sort of the, how I tried to avoid the uh, attack. If it's, if it's all right, you yes, know? yes, sir. If, if 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 I'm walking this way to the door of my office in the bedroom, the door is where you are. I, I'd walked across the the mezzanine there, and, and um, as I'm approaching the door, suddenly I'm just getting cl clobbered from behind, and and one's natural primal instinct is to is to kind of duck and cover. So I ducked and covered, but they didn't stop. So I I came up this this like this, um, sort of protecting my face, but at the same time, with their arms swinging wildly, I uh, I put my arms out and I and I was able to get her into a uh, like a what do you a bear hug or something just to to stop her from hitting me anymore. Um, and while holding her in that position, uh, she was still trying to. You know, she had her legs. She had her. She could kick, she could, you know, she could knee me. Uh, so she, she was still um, jump, you know, kind of very angry, very animated. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah, it was unpleasant. What happened at the end of that situation? Because of the grabbing of the arms and, and, and holding them to her side so that I didn't receive any more blows, 
um, and and she was still fighting. I believe there was some kind of contact with our our heads, our foreheads, as would happen if you're trying to uh, calm someone like that. Um, and then that was when she uh, accused me of head headbutting her, uh, of, of, of giving her a a headbutt and uh, breaking her nose. But um, there was there was no blood. There was no, I, I didn't hit her nose. I, if there was anything at all, it was a, it, it was a bump of, uh, well, I'm trying to restrain her. She's trying to get out of it. There's going to be some contact here and there, accidental contact, but not a headbutt. How did you uh, escape this altercation? After she'd made the remark about the fact that I headbutted her, which which was just impossible, um, she she split. She she huffed off. I, I let her go. She huffed away, and she was gone for about seven or eight minutes. And then when she came back, I was in the, I was, then I was in the bedroom of penthouse three, our bedroom. And she came back about seven or eight minutes later and she had a Kleenex or a tissue to her nose. And, um, and she, then she pulled it away from her nose and she showed it to me and there was red it was indeed like red color on the on the tissue but me i know that there was no connection to her nose N no part of my body made connection to her nose or eyes or anything like so she said uh, she took it away and she showed it to me she said way to go johnny you broke my nose you broke my nose and I knew I hadn't, so I said, "In you go into sort of placation mode, which is, oh my God, let me see, are you okay? What happened? Let me, let me see. And she wouldn't let me see anything. And so I just tried to calm the situation as best I could. Um, all the while, I was waiting for her um, to dispense with that Kleenex because I didn't trust it. And so I waited and when she dropped it into the waste basket in her bathroom <clears throat> or in our bathroom and uh, left the room, went somewhere downstairs, I think, I don't know. And then I pulled the Kleenex out of the, out of the trash uh, bin and I inspected it pretty closely and realized that it was nail polish. It was nail varnish or polish. <clears throat> Mr. Depp, shortly after December 15th, 2015, where did you and Miss Heard go for the holidays? Um, we, there was, it was, uh, had been planned for a while that we would be going to the island and we would be going to the island with my um, my kids, um, Lily Rose and Jack, and Lily Rose's boyfriend at the time, uh, and and um, uh, there there were uh, there was a friend of Amber's called uh, Alice Temperley, I believe her name was, is, and her boyfriend Greg Williams, who's a, a, a very well-known photographer and a, a 
both very nice people and their kids were going to, she, she told me they were going to be coming to, to the island and I thought, okay, great. Um, and so, yeah, that's, 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 so that's where we went for the holidays. And what happened on the island in December 2015? Yeah, it did many things. But, um, Was there any violence by Miss Heard against you? Oh, yes, there were, there were, there was, uh, there were a couple of incidents that were, again, just each time the, one of these incidents would occur, it, it seemed to get worse and worse. That is to say, as opposed to fists or anything like that, um, I'd set up on the, on the back porch of the house, I'd set up an area, um, with a, an easel and oil paints and, uh, a can of mineral spirits, linseed oil, brushes, everything. So she wanted to paint. So I had set it up for, uh, and, and for some, and again, I remember I was sitting at the table where most of the uh, paintbrushes and the can and all that stuff was. And uh, the argument, again, escalated, 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 and she simply reached down and grabbed a can of the can of min mineral spirits and uh, and uh, chucked it at my face, she threw it at my face and it, it, uh, it, 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 it struck me right at the bridge of the nose, sort of the forehead bridge of the nose area. And, uh, it hurt. Who else was around when this happened? Well, thankfully my children and uh, Lily Rose's boyfriend were over towards the cafe. Um, I, I, at that point, I didn't know uh, that anyone else had uh, was around or had witnessed anything. Uh, I thought it was just Amber and I, but apparently, um, the, 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 there are four staff who, who, who work on the island. I don't think it's your I don't think any such statements yet. You can go ahead and continue your answer, sir. Okay. Um, um, Sorry, this the staff that work on your island, Mr. Depp. Yeah. So there are indeed four staff who work on on the island and live there uh, all year round. Um, who take care of everything, and uh, two of them happened to be in that area and witnessed the uh, uh, violence. How, how sustained as to, unless you can lay a foundation, how he would know Certainly. that if it was not hearsay. Mr. Depp, how do you know that these staff members witnessed part of this altercation? These people, as I said, they, 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 there's, there's staff on the island, though I consider them family and, and very dear to me. And uh, I, I believe it's, it is mutual. I've known them a very long time. Um, they were visibly, um, they were visibly shaken 